There is not one, but two different episodes of The Simpsons where Homer seems to find counterexamples, two different counterexamples to Fermat's last theorem. Uh, that is, here and here, he finds a 12th power of an integer that is the sum of two 12th powers of integers. And those examples should not exist. And that's because there is a theorem in mathematics with a long history called Fermat's last theorem that was first claimed by Fermat around 1637 and proved by Andrew Wiles and Richard Taylor in 1995 uh, that says that a cube cannot be the sum of two cubes, a fourth power cannot be the sum of two fourth powers, and so on, an nth power cannot be the sum of two nth powers. So what Homer finds are not examples that do not exist, but examples that are almost right. They are near misses of Fermat's last theorem in the sense, in this case, that if you take a 12th root of that number and a 12th root of that number, then the numbers are so close that a regular calculator cannot tell them apart. You can see with a good calculator that the 12th root of the sum of the 12 powers is 4,472 to enough precision that a regular calculator would say it is exactly 4,472, although it is not. And in fact, you can see if you expand those uh, 12 powers that around that digit right here, they start differing. So they are actually very far apart. Similarly, the other example that appears in The Simpsons is one similar example where uh, the 12th root is very close to 1921, but the actual solutions are extremely far apart. So this got me thinking, can I find solutions or near misses to Fermat's equation where the nth power and the sum of the two nth powers, the decimal expansion, only differs by one digit. So at first sight, it looks like they're exactly the same number. So I got cracking, wrote some code to try to find examples, and one can find such examples quite easily. For example, 100 cube and 31 cube plus 99 cube, they're not equal, like Fermat's last theorem says, but their decimal expansion differ by one digit, by one nine. And you can even pick what digit differs and try to find near misses where that one digit is the one that misses. For example, uh, this one, the, only the unit's digit is different. In this example, they are the same except for the second digit, a five becomes a seven. In this example, the fifth digit differs, a three is a five. In this one, some two is a four. And you can find similar near misses for other exponents. This is for fourth powers. And here is another larger example for fourth powers. So let me know in the comments if you find any other interesting near misses.